The death toll continues to rise following two suicide bombings in Afghanistan near the Kabul airport on Thursday. The blast killed 13 U.S. service members and injured 18 more, according to the head of U.S. Central Command. Officials in Kabul say 169 Afghans died, with dozens more injured. President Joe Biden vowed revenge. For those who carried out this attack, as well as anyone who wishes America harm, know this. We will not forgive. We will not forget. We will hunt you down and make you pay. ISIS-K took responsibility for the Thursday attacks, identifying as the Afghan affiliate of the terrorist group ISIS. The Pentagon is warning of additional attacks, as are American allies. The threat is obviously going to grow the closer we get to leaving. As we leave, uh, certain groups such as ISIS will want to stake a claim that they have driven out the U.S. or the U.K. The U.S. State Department is urging Americans to avoid the airport as U.S. forces continue their urgent evacuation efforts. The White House says that more than 12,000 people have been evacuated from Kabul since Thursday morning.